Hello and welcome back to more Let's Play Chrono Trigger. In the previous episode, we got Jerky, and now we're gonna go hand it to the people on Zenon Bridge. Uh oh, things are looking dire here. Mere mortals can never expect to beat Magus' troops. Ah! Our food supply has run out. The hero has made it across the bridge somehow, but our troops have suffered heavy losses. Net Captain, Sir Daniel! Is that for us? Yes. Food rations! The cook, he has saved us all. Sir Daniel, if I do not make it back, give my brother my thanks. You'll make it back. I'm here, bro. What is going on here? Magus' troops have launched an attack. They're breaking through our defenses. Stop sniveling. It shames the Knights of the Square Table. Good lord, Knights of the Square Table. We shall destroy Magus' troops and bring honor to our king. But we are far outnumbered. This is our last line of defense. We must let no one through. Understood. Hey, I'll fight. Let's go. I'm going. Oh! Whoa, whoa! Uh... They just stood there and died. That's no good. I'm Ozzy, Magus's top general. Those who dare defy Magus have, a an have to answer to me. We met your ancestor. He's as fat as you are. Yes, my children, give him a taste of doom. Sure, these deceased are gonna give me a taste of doom. You see, and this is where, earlier in the game, I thought you had to use some kind of, like, special move on them. And it's not until this point that they actually start, well, taking damage from, like, needing fire or something. I believe I need the flame roll to do some ultimate damage to them. I could be wrong. And? Eh, that's some decent damage, anyway. Oh, well, if we just did one attack, I suppose we'd be fine. And Ozzy's all low, so just smack him. And now he runs away. Ozzy needs help! If I had enough time to read that, actually. Those whimpers are stronger than I thought. Those whimperers? Those wimps are, is what it, I should have said. Wait up already. For a fat guy, he's pretty fast. Seems I misjudged you, but I won't do that twice. So he sends three of them against us. Hey, oh. Grr, you're through. Uh, no, I'm not. There's one for each of us. Lightning. Ice. Fire. Do, 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 do. Oh, that's lame. He lived. Good job. And I guess fire is probably going to finish you off as well. Fire does a lot of damage to the undead. And you can just it. And he's Ozzy needs help. And he runs off again. Daniel leveled up. Drat. Drat it. That's it. Now you're finished. You said that last time. Don't mess with Daniel, or you'll real you'll really be sorry. Yeah, I'm that tough. Uh, four of them. Sure. Uh, hey, oh, wait a minute. Oh. Meet Zombor. Go, Zombor. Crush Sir Magus' enemies. 
basically, I believe his top half is immune to lightning, and his bottom half isn't. Yep, that would be accurate. His top half is immune to fire, but it's not immune to ice. Is that it? Yes, that would be accurate. Okay. So basically, I'm just gonna use magic until he dies. There we go. Really simple battle. He doesn't have that much health either. He's gonna start using his like delta move or something like that. Okay, that did damage. Doom doom, yeah. See, doom doom doom. That's what it is. And it does some. Well, as you saw, some massive damage. I'm probably gonna use Aurora real quick here. If Aurora will pop up, thank you. Fire, bottom half. Oh, but his bottom half is gone, and his top half is floating. Well, as long as she doesn't die, we're good. Or a whirl. But fire's not gonna work. I don't know if I can attack normally. Let's see. I can, okay. I just can't use lightning or fire on the top half. I'd imagine that's gonna leave her with like one health. No? Alright. Or a whirl! MP Buster steals MP. Yeah, he basically does that on the last character to hit him. Mandalorian, right up. And that is everything on the bridge. Yeah. Let's go ahead and talk to you. Thanks to Sir Daniel, we had we held the bridge, but unless we defeat Magus, this is an empty victory. We held Zenon Bridge with Sir Daniel's help. Now, I'm actually pretty sure I missed out on an item. I'm pretty sure if I had talked to uh, this guy before, um, before having attacked everyone on the bridge, I would have gotten a golden helm. I'm pretty sure. But I, I messed up there, so. Oh well. What we do need to do here. Oh, alright. These are humans. The hero has appeared? That means the epic battle will begin. Welcome, what can I do for you? I probably need to get a couple of revives, to be honest. We'll get ten of them. Shelters, although we can get them for free. I feel like getting a few. Twenty-five cents if we can cover. Mid-tonics, I'll grab a few. 
All right, we're good. Thanks a lot. Residents. Mom said I can't play outside because of the monsters. I'm so bored. Is it true the king was injured? What's going to happen to us and to our country? Well, I'm going to fix everything. It's locked. Oh. I heard Magus knows arcane magic, with the that, which the monsters can't match. Oh, where could Sir Cyrus be? Surely he hasn't deserted the kingdom. I guess he hasn't. That's still locked. <coughs> Darina Inn. Our Magus' army is really closing it. Well, the mythical hero has appeared, so we'll be alright. Okay. Want to hear my tale? Sure. Goblins with huge hammers roam the Dorona Mountains to the east. But burn their weapons and their pussycats. Alright. Thanks for the hint. Did you know they say the mystical Moss Mas Immune lies deep within the Den Ardro Denadoral Mountains? But it's guarded by terrible beasts. Clear your conscience and the end of the world the end of the world is coming. Okay? Many people go to the end if you seek someone to ask there. By the way, energy whirls will dissipate if you use your slash attack. Okay? There's a balance in nature. That's a hint for later on on the bath boss battle. Magus is trying to bring forth an immense evil. If he succeeds, there will be nowhere to run. We're all, we'll all perish. That's why I'm living it up now. At a bar. Yep, you're living it up. Hello there, this is R&R &R Hotel. It'll cost you 50 gold. Well, uh, no. What a shame, I'll wait for you to come back. A sword called the something or another moon was made hundreds of years ago. No one has the skill to make a sword like that anymore. Have you met the hero already? No. I haven't met him either. I wonder what the champion of the world looks like. I'm so excited. It looks like me because I am the champion of the world. Wow, I wish I could get a gun some of them. I've got butterflies. Oh, I see how it is. Basically, she likes them already. Never seen him, but she likes them. Which is ridiculous. Because I know what he looks like. And I know who he really is. That's actually kind of funny. Uh, hello? Hey, no problem. It's like, I'm the mythical explorer, and good match, uh, chief. Hmm, I'll be waiting for good news. With that settled, I'll grab a bite before I go. Basically, I'm busy right now. Let's talk later. That is Toma. The mystical... Hero. Right. We can use the rainbow shell to make some reflective armor. It would be strong against magic. But the guy's a little flaky. Was it a mistake to trust him? Uh, yeah, a bit. The hero has come. He's strong and he's gonna trash those monsters. Or thrash, if I can read it right. Only the ancient sword Masamu can defeat him, and only the hero can wield it. The chief of... San Dorino Village lives here. Are you foreigners? Did you flee from Magus' troops? No, no we've not. We're actually heading toward them. Magus has three fearsome henchmen. Ozzy, Flea, and Slash. They're tone deaf evil fiends. Okay. Magus' lairs on the islands to the east. Sheer cliffs make it inaccessible. Well, that's no good. I guess we're gonna have to cross mountains and whatnot. And, and water. Because he's on an island. Right, oh, so. Let's check this. What's this? Fiona's Villa. My husband Marco hasn't returned from the war. But these woods mean a lot to us, so I'll guard them until he returns. Oh. I believe we heard something about a lady who was like that in the future? Or in no one here. Market. 
I'm gonna put on this armor and fight that stupid Magus. Okay? Don't overdo it. Yeah, it's heavy. Uh, did he just pass out? Okay, then. Found one power tab. Okay, oh. <laughs> Well, it appears we can buy gold suits for everyone, if I wanted to. I'm not going to, though. That would be ridiculous at this point. <coughs> Two barrettes I can buy, though. Two. And I'll go ahead and equip them onto everyone. Barrette. Barrette. There we are. And we can continue on. Cafe. A strange monster came by the other day, mumbling about Queen Leanne and the Moss of you. That sure were an ugly frog, hardy horror. Ah, huh, so Frog was here. Or, Hefe. I can't believe the legendary hero was a boy from this village. Did you hear the latest? No. Well, I remember that legendary hero is from this village, then. Okay. I can't believe the legendary hero is that naughty runt Tata. Oh, that was Toma. Okay. I was wrong there. That was not the legendary hero that we saw earlier. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. What are you doing in this corner? Have you heard about the magical cave, the one east of the Den Adoro Mountains? I saw a rock wall there pop open and a gaggle of ghouls just walk right in. Best to leave Magus and his cronies alone, though. Oh. So that, they, there's a secret cave to his island. Hmm. Keep that in mind for later. This is Tata's house. The hero. My son's legendary hero. It must have been all that oatmeal. And to think I, that I'm his father. Hey, oh. My grandson's a brave hero. That's from, that's from my side of the family. He, he, he. Oh, I see. Elder's house. I think we're already here. I'm gonna marry Tata. Sure. We got two empty, well, two ch locked chests. If only I had some jerky, what a great meal I could make. Huh. Next to the bed is a treasure box. Open it, the contents are yours. Village chief. Uh, the magic cave lies under a mountain east of Denadoro. Okay. Tata received the hero's medal. At first I thought it was fake. He must have done something very brave. He's probably up north looking for the legendary sword. Okay, so let's head north. To the Denadaro Mountains. We could head this way, but there's no point. I think. Let me check. Actually, no, I do understand that there's no point in there right now. That's the Cursed Woods. And basically, we can't do anything there yet. Now then, we keep hearing, there is like a cave somewhere over here. Magic cave, yeah. And see, we can't open it at this point. It was interrupted there real quick. Anywho. But yeah, basically we can't do anything here yet. We'll have to come back later. Once we've crossed the Denadaro Mountains, which I'm gonna go ahead and use a shelter. And go ahead, organize. I can use those power tabs real quick, actually. So, power tabs. I'm gonna go ahead and use them both on them. <laughs> Speed tab. Because I don't care, I, I throw everything on Chrono. Or, you know, Daniel. I'm gonna keep mixing it up, I know I will. And it's been 20 minutes, so I'll see you all in the next episode, where we're going to go ahead and climb these mountains and hopefully meet up with Ta Tata. So, see you all then.